The grocery retail industry has gone through uh, significant changes in recent years, right? The landscape is changing, the macroeconomic factors are changing. And we are seeing a lot of niche players coming in this space, right? There is always a growing emphasis on environmental friendly products, uh, waste reduction and responsible sourcing. And the consumers are really increasingly seeking value, healthier products and convenience, right? And with that, uh, the emergence of new technology is happening and there's always a need of customization. Uh, the grocers need to make a quick and informed decision on technology, right? That's a very, very, very considerable challenge because... Um, you know, the technology is powerful, but it's not proven yet. And that's where um, Cognizant comes in, you know, Cognizant approaches uh, to start with the ideation and innovation. We explore new technologies and hopefully we are able to co-create engaging experience for consumers and employees. Um, and as a result, we are able to contextualize the problems and the needs and hopefully connect the dots between their business problems and technology solutions, right? Uh, with over 6,000 associates, um, we're specialized in grocery and convenience market. Cognizant is able to deliver value across the top grocery retailers uh, with focus and agility. You know, we have access to real-time data now and which um, a retailer is able to make faster, more informed decision and obviously impact the CX, uh, which is delivered to them. Now, for example, if the shopper sh shares the information with retailers, I and mean, they're expecting a very personalized returns, right? Like experience, product recommendations, tailored content, and all that. But to create these interactions, retailers need to harmonize the data sets. Uh, and of course, Gen AI coming into picture, they allow retailers to anticipate the behaviors and catered and offer catered recommendations, right? Another example is loyalty. To earn the royalty, retailers need to prove that they know their customers as individuals and using data effectively to inform every interaction and touch point. Um, now, the list is endless. Another example is visibility, right? Shop where I want and where when I want it, right? Access to product and availability across all channels is very key to the consumer experience. So, automatic checkout process, dynamic pricing, sh smart shopping list. I mean, the list is endless. Now, another uniqueness in the grocery, grocer experience is uh, the freshness and the quality of the product, right? Now, with improved supply chain management, um, uh, you know, we can. it can lead to a fresher product being available on the store. And of course, it enhances the quality of the groceries and of course, then overall shopping experience. So I would say with changing scenarios and the Gen AI, you know, uh, we can play a big role in uh, improving the consumer experience end to end. Yeah, like I said in the beginning, uh, the grocery industry is going through a huge amount of changes, right? One of the big change which we are seeing is the omni-channel experience or the shopping experience. Uh, uh, and with the advent of social uh, commerce, I mean, things are changing so fast. People are now willing to obviously uh, do online shopping and as well as uh, social shopping for, for the groceries. There is a factor of sustainability which is coming in. There's always a price sensitivity involved uh, from that perspective. And I'm also seeing a lot of retail media where the grocers are using the store advertising and di digital screens to enhance the overall shopping experience. And of course, the health and wellness always continues to be the prime challenge in the forefront. Now, on all of these uh, trends, uh, we have the power experience, which is super important. The consumer, the, the associate experience, or even the partner and the vendor experience, uh, right? And that's where we come in. We understand the domain very well. Uh, we understand the various personas and, of course, the criticality in the ecosystem uh, of those personas. And with our technical expertise, we are able to marry or bring all these three factors together and, of course, unlock the potential of uh, with many of our grocery partners across the globe. Um, for example, we have de developed first of its kind digital marketplace for a leading grocery detail chain. Uh, we have got uh, advanced merchandising operation systems for right stocking for one of the top uh, grocery chains in the UK. And the list is endless. So we continue to help our customers all across in the grocery industry through our experience and expertise. I've got two Gen Zs in my house. Uh, I've got a 19 year old and a 16 year old. Uh, one of my biggest challenges is how do I drive them to a grocery store, right? It's an experience that uh, they should remember, right? Not that, you know, you got to really push them out. And that's where I think it's super important to understand what Gen Zs are thinking. And of course now uh, the Zen Alpha are coming, they come with a very different buying pattern, different behavior for them. Probably the convenience and the ease of shopping is the most important thing. Or even if they are dragged to these stores, um, 
you know, they should really feel that they really want to shop around, not just go to one place and pick up uh, the item and then just get out, right? I can take an example of HEP grocery stores in, in Texas, in Dallas. I mean, that's something which me and my family enjoys really well because uh, this this grocery store really knows, uh, you know, what what to cater to this young generation. So, you know, we can spend an hour there because there is uh, enough and for everybody, my wife, me, and my kids as well, right? So, of course, with the... Um, movement of analytics across we do understand what their buying pattern is uh, what are they shopping for where are they spending time in the social media can we also do some pervasive advertisements uh, where they are present most of the time and that's where i think we need to focus on every grocer is trying to figure out uh, what gen z's and then zen alpha are really going to look for and uh, if we have really broken the code there I mean, I think we are very successful. So, you know, that, that problem statement continues. But I'm sure we'll be able to solve that uh, with all the technology that's available for us. This industry is changing. There has gone through a lot of uh, ups and downs in the past. And there is new technology that's available. You know, everybody wants to en- embrace Gen AI. Uh, you know, people are say, skeptical. But I think if we are able to use it very effectively, and smartly, I think we can unlock a huge potential there itself. And uh, Cognizant as an organization will continue to help solve their problems. And hopefully we'll have all the happy grocers and drive traffic through Gen Z's and Gen Alpha, which is, which is something which is very important to all of us.